Hello and welcome to this screencast in which I will demonstrate some possible use cases of Plon Commons product. See general information about this product and installation instructions in Plon Commons screencast in the Quinta Group Plon screencast channel. In this screencast we will talk about such issues as integration of Plon Commons with Plon Captures, anonymous commenting with Plon Commons and registered users commenting. Plon Commons are usually posted by filling such fields as subject and comment when logged in user is adding this comment. There are also name and email fields for anonymous users. To protect your content from occasional comments, you can use additional capture field. You can make all comments posting more secure with our Cube-Plon Captures product. Simply install it in your instance and uh, as a result you will have additional capture field on all comment forms on your website. To allow anonymous users to post comments, you have to select the corresponding option in Plon Comment Setup. Besides, you can select Require emails from anonymous commenters to make commenters leave their emails when posting new comments. Let's have a look at one of the possible use cases when anonymous users want to post their comments. Everything will be demonstrated on content management software.info website. So, anonymous user goes to this website and posts a new comment by pressing Add Comment button. He fills all the required fields and presses Save. He will see an info message appeared saying that all comments require approval before being published. When a new comment is added, notification email is sent to the email address entered in Plon Commons config light. When a responsible person uh, goes to his email inbox, he sees a new message from this website saying that new comment awaits moderation. When opening this email, he'll see a link to the article that was commented, so he goes to this article by following this link and sees a new command where he can remove or publish it. Let's press publish. As a result, this comment becomes visible to all site visitors. Let's now consider a different example when only registered users are allowed to add comments. This can be achieved by disallowing anonymous users to add comments by unchecking this option in Plon Comment Setup. Since now we will deal with registered users only, we can um, configure sending notification email to their email addresses when their comments are published, reject or receiving a reply. We can select both of them and press save to save our options. Let's have a look at how all this works. Again, a visitor is on our website and he wants to leave a comment. But instead of add comment button, he'll see login to add comments button. So he presses this and is asked to login before adding comments. If he is not a registered user, he can register over here or simply uh, put in his login name and password if he was registered before. Let's fill our login name and password and press login. Only now when a visitor is logged in, he can add comments. He presses as usually add comment button fills in all of the fields, press save and again info message is appeared saying that all comments require approval before being published. After a new comment was added, notification email is sent to the email address entered in Plon Comment Setup box. So a responsible person checks this email 
and sees a message from this website about new comment that awaits moderation. He follows the link in the message and here he can remove or publish a new comment. Since we selected notify commenter when comment is published option, this means that a comment author will receive a notification email telling him that his comment was published. Such emails will also be sent in case uh, his comment is deleted or his comment receives a reply. See more information about our Plon Comments and Plon Captures products on the provided links. Thank you for listening and come back to us next time.